all you space engineers out there, Commander Kingfish here, and it is Mod Wednesday. So today's mod is a little unique in that uh, it is, well, it kind of has a, a Star Wars theme. And we're going to highlight, uh, it's called a Moisture Vapor Rider. Vapor Rider and it is by Slowpoke Farm as well as uh, help with from the model itself by Stoli and work by Anarch Cassius. So uh, it really if you've landed in the desert uh, and you need ice right you, you need ice at a bare minimum for your hydrogen uh, if you're on an Earth-like planet that has oxygen, you're you're good in that respect. But uh, you need you need ice so you can generate your hydrogen. Well, what this moisture evaporator does is uh, produces ice. Now, depending on the density of your planet, and it's you got to have a, a dense atmosphere, so it doesn't work in space. Uh, but usually there's quite a bit of ice in space. So what you do is uh, it uh, you build it and it produces ice uh, at, uh, what is it, uh, 0 0.024 kilograms per second from a 100% density atmosphere. So as you can see, this uh, moisture vapor evaporator is uh, producing ice. So now you have the ability to keep your hydrogen bottles filled uh, and you're not having to constantly go out and mine ice. As you can see, it's pretty much a standard construction. Uh, 80 steel plates, 30 construction components, uh, large and small tubes, uh, motors and computers so you pretty much can build this uh, when you first uh, uh, first part of the game uh, first part of your uh, survival uh, you I think you can build all of this in your survival kit I can't remember exactly but I'm pretty sure you can uh, if not then it would be once you got your basic uh, basic assembler that you would certainly be able to build everything. Uh, it uh, uh, takes normal uh, power so you can see that I've got batteries set up here so it's running off of that if you uh, you can turn it on and off uh, there we go turn so in your control panel uh, you can see you've got pretty much basically everything that you would normally expect. Uh, nothing fancy, basically just off and on. Uh, you can kind of see that it's 400 kilowatts. And so, yeah. Uh, this is a, a really nice item to have if you're having difficulties getting ice. Uh, I think there's a lot of places now where there is a layer of ice. Uh, out there or that you can find ice eh, d depending on where you're at I mean obviously I've been landing in the uh, Arctic a lot so ice is not a problem up there but out here in the desert yeah you need a moisture evaporator and if nothing else it's a very nice looking piece of uh, equipment to have set up around your base so it looks which is pretty cool now you can kind of see uh, it does have some uh, motion to it so like uh, gives the appearance of uh, I think solar panels uh, although those aren't functioning solar panels but they do turn turn and so you do have some action with it anyway uh, that is the moisture evaporator and obviously all these Star Wars buffs out there will recognize it 
Uh, many thanks to uh, Slowpoke and Stoli and Anarchy, Anarch. Uh, this is a great, uh, great addition to the game. Uh, so with that, I think uh, that will conclude uh, Mod Wednesday. If you like it, hit that thumbs up. It really helps out the video. And uh, uh, please subscribe. It helps the channel out considerably. Uh, with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here, and I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.